kindly subscribe to our youtube channel to watch the full lecture hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel from this video we will be starting a new chapter that is labor costing or employees costing this chapter comes in cost accounting subject and whatever the videos i am making it is based on the nep scheme so the theory part of, part of this chapter i'll be making a separate video and i'll be sharing the link so before going to exam one or two days you can revise that video so that whatever the theory questions asked in the examination you will be able to answer it so theory part i'll be making a separate video now in this video let us see how to prepare an employee cost or labor costing now there are many ways to prepare so for example first is time rate system time rate system so in this time rate system the payment is made based on hours worked illi payment na based on hours worked mele kodta ire eshtottu neevu kelsa maadirtira adr mele nimge dudduna athwa samlavanna koduvantaddu idakke formula enu andre the wages is equal to hours worked into rate before only they would have told that per hour you will be paid some amount that per hour rate is known as rate per work now this is one type that is time rate system there is a second type that is piece rate system piece rate system so what does this piece rate system says means the payment is made based on number of pieces you produce based on number of pieces you manufacture illi payment inda nee eshtu pieces galna eshtu product galna manufacture martira aa ondu basis mele payment anna maduvantahaddu so here formula will be number of units produced number of units produced into rate per unit so they would they would have told that if you pro for one unit we will pay this much amount so on based on number of units you have produced they will pay certain rate so idu piece rate system next we have halse plan so we have halse plan this is introduced by fh f a halse so this halse plan it is a combination of both time rate as well as piece rate so above we saw melgade eradu bere bere time rate system matte piece rate system na nodidvi halse plan bandu combination of both ee eradu rudu combination so here halse will mainly talk about the time saved for example we would have given 18 hours for you to do a work but you will finish the work within 16 hours so 2 hours you have saved the time so what halse tells for this 2 hours bonus should be given iga for example 18 hours nimge time kottirtivi kelsa madadikke neevu aa ondu kelsa na 16 hours alle mugustira so 2 hours na neevu save madidira so halse yen heltare andre a 2 hour neevu en save madidirala adakke bonus na kodbeku anta so here halse is also talking about bonus so what does he says bonus should be given on the basis of 50% of time saved into rate per hour iga avaru eshtu ಟೈಮ್ ಸೇವ್ ಮಾಡಿರ್ತಾರಲ್ಲ ಅಷ್ಟು ಅವರ್ಸ್ಗೆ ರೇಟನ್ನು ಹಾಕಿ ಏನು ಬರುತ್ತಲ್ಲ ಅದರಲ್ಲಿ ಫಿಫ್ಟಿ ಪರ್ಸೆಂಟ್ನ ಕೊಟ್ಟರೆ ಅದನ್ನು ಬೋನ
this is for bonus iga time saved ge en anta heltare formula halse idrale andre time saved andre standard time means the time which they have given avaru nimige yav time al mugusbeku anta helirtarala adu standard time minus time taken neevu eshtu samyana tagondirtira anta so the formula of total earnings so this is the formula of halse what is the formula of halse it is nothing but time taken time taken into rate per hour so how much you have taken the time for that per hour rate plus bonus bonus is nothing but 50% of the time saved into rate per hour so hope you have understood now see the question question is on the screen so we need to calculate the total earnings of the worker using halse plan always write in the exam what they have given in the question so it will be easy for you to answer the problem so calculate total earnings and effective wage rate per hour halse plan time allowed is 48 hours time taken is 40 hours rate per hour is 10 rupees ಸೊ ನಿಮಗೆ ಅವರು ನಲವತ್ತೆಂಟು ಅವರ್ ಕೆಲಸ ಮಾಡೋಕ್ಕೆ ಅವಕಾಶ ಕೊಟ್ಟಿದ್ದಾರೆ ಆದರೆ ನೀವೆಷ್ಟು ತೊಗೊಂಡಿದ್ದೀರಾ ಫಾರ್ಟಿ ಅವರ್ಸ್ ನಿಮಗೆ ಅವರು ಪರ್ ಅವರ್ ಟೆನ್ ರುಪೀಸ್ ಪೇ ಮಾಡ್ತೀನಿ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿದರು ನಾವು ಲೆಟ್ ಅಸ್ ಸಿ ಹೌ ಟು ಕ್ಯಾಲ್ಕುಲೇಟ್ ಸೊ ಕ್ಯಾಲ್ಕುಲೇಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಟೋಟಲ್ ಕ್ಯಾಲ್ಕುಲೇಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಟೋಟಲ್ ಅರ್ನಿಕ್ಸ್ ಅಂಡರ್ ಅಲ್ಸೆ ಪ್ಲಾನ್ now what they have given they have given time allowed time allowed is nothing but the standard time how much is the standard time standard time is 48 hours then they have given us time taken how much is the time taken time taken is 40 hours now rate per hour so per hour is pay martini anta helidare per hour they are paying rupees 10 now we have standard time and time taken so we can find out the time saved isn't it what is the formula for time saved it is standard time minus time taken standard time minus time taken here standard time is 48 hours time taken is 40 hours so time saved is 8 hours so 8 hours he has saved the time isn't it now we got to know the time saved so what is the formula of halse the formula is here i'll write time taken into rate per hour this is one segment for that we need to give bonus so what is the formula for giving bonus it is nothing but the 50% of time saved into rate per hour so this is the formula now let us try to put the numericals for this so now time taken how much is the time taken time taken is 40 into rate per hour is rupees 10 10 put it inside the bracket plus 50% of time saved how much is the time saved time saved is 8 hours so 8 hours into rate per hour is 10 rupees so time taken is to 40 hours so rate per hour 10 rupees so plus 50% of time saved time saved is to 8 hours rate per hour is 10 hours now 40 into 10 is 400 plus 50% of 8 10 is 80 so 400 plus 50% of 80 is 40 50% of 80 is 40 so 400 plus 40 is equal to 400 and 40 so 
This is the total earnings. If 440 is the total earnings. Now, we need, they have asked one more thing. Find the effective wage rate per hour. So, to find effective wage rate per hour, there is a formula. What is that formula? It is nothing but total earnings. divided by actual time taken now how much is the total earnings is total earnings is 440 divided by what is the actual time taken actual time taken is 40 hours so 40 so when you divide both you will get rupees 11 this rupees 11 is nothing but the effective wage rate see actually he was supposed to be paid 10 rupees only but he is getting 11 rupees per hour because of time save this is all about halse plan of wage rate system so hope you understood this video very well so the notes for this i have put in the first comment kindly download the notes and practice well thank you if you have any queries regarding today's session Kindly send your queries to education.mbbroadcast at gmail.com.